Mookie Blaylock, one of the most dynamic players known for his defensive prowess and exceptional three-point shooting. As a point guard, he possessed incredible court vision and was skilled at setting up his teammates for scoring opportunities. His quick hands and defensive instincts made him one of the best steal artists of the 90s era, consistently disrupting opponents' offenses and creating turnovers. Blaylock's ability to read passing lanes and anticipate plays earned him numerous all-defensive team selections. Additionally, he was a deadly three-point shooter, capable of draining shots from the long range and spreading the floor for his team. His contributions on both ends of the court made him a valuable asset to any team he played for and a respected figure in the league during his career. A 94 NBA All-Star. Even though he was not a huge scorer, Blaylock was an outstanding three-point shooter making a significant impact beyond the arc, leading the league in three points made during the 96-97 season. Now, while he never won a championship on any of the teams he played for, like I mentioned, he was a defensive first type of guard, making consecutive all-defensive first teams 94 and 95 and all-defensive second teams 96 and 97. Steals leader for two consecutive seasons in 96 and 97. Playing alongside some of the greats of the 90s era, some of the most notable teammates he played with included Hall of Famer Dominique Wilkins. Wilkins was one of the NBA's premier scorers and a highlight reel dunker. Steve Smith, a skilled shooting guard known for his scoring and perimeter shooting. And the Kimbe Mutombo. The chemistry between these two was evident in their ability to complement each other's defensive strengths. Bladelock's perimeter defense combined with Mutombo's shot blocking and rebounds in the paint created a well-rounded defensive unit for the Hawks. Not to mention, his playmaking skills and Matumbo's ability to score in the post added a balance to the team. Blaylock, again, was not a prolific shooter, but he efficiently ran the offense and distributed the ball, often setting up Matumbo for a high percentage shot near the basket. These are just a few examples of the teammates he had the pleasure of playing with. I used to love watching the Hawks at that time, especially when they would go up against the Knicks. That was a real rivalry right there. Every time they faced off, it was intense, and you knew it was going to get physical. Up in here, up in here, y'all gonna make... Okay. Can't forget about when they would go up against Miami. You knew that every basket would be closely contested. These rivalries added an extra level of intensity and drama in the regular season games and playoffs. Me and my brothers often look forward to these games. There it is. I'm just wanted to give a quick shout out to my boy Mookie Blaylock, a well underrated guard, one of the best defensive point guards in my book, only second to the glove. But thank y'all for listening and checking me out. I will see y'all in the next one. Y'all have a good rest of y'all night.